going to do is how to change the background color of your app. So go ahead and open Xcode. Uh, click on single view application. Click next. Uh, give your app a name. So we're just going to say one, two, three, four. We're going to save that to the desktop. Just save it to wherever your apps are saved. And click create. Now, changing the color in the background of an app is good for two things. You can, one, create a custom appearance. And two, it's kind of useful for the debugging process as well. If you have any problems when you're changing to a new view controller or anything like that. So I'll show you how to do this now. So what you're going to do is go to your view controller dot swift, and we're going to change the color of the view when the view loads. So this function here says when the view loads, do x, y, and z. So what we're going to do is change the color when the view loads. So we're going to say self self dot view dot background color it's going to be equal to UI color uh, sorry. UI color dot whatever color you want so usually they have predetermined colors in there already so look the reds purples you can type in green whatever you want but these colors are usually really vivid uh, and you don't really want that so I'll just show you this green for example and we'll run it on a iPhone 5 <clears throat> so you see here the green that's already in Xcode is really it's usually a really bright green a usually vivid green and same with the, the other colors that are in there, like the reds, the yellows, so are usually really bright. It's a bit slow today, so in we go. Should load up now, so it should be load up with kind of a, a bright, bright green. And there you go. So that's that's you're changing the view in the back as a green. So we don't really usually want these bright colors. You usually you're gonna have a a color in your in your mind for, that you already want. And so what you do is just go get the RGB values now. So the red, green, blue, blue values. And then to get that specific color in the background, we're gonna use this. So we're gonna say same again. So self dot view dot background. So you're actually in the background color of the view, and it's going to be equal to a UI color. Open brackets, and you can see here red green flow. Yeah, red green blue alpha flow, and it's going to be like type CG float. So what you're going to do, say my color is going to be, I'm just going to make up a color here, a hundred, red. Uh, one fifty green and I want a value of 20 in blue. You're going to set your alpha to 1 so that means you can see the color. Uh, your alpha is between 0 and 1 so it's kind of the transparency level. It'll uh, kind of fit 0 is black, 1 is your color so you can kind of mess around with that to kind of get a little fade, faded color. So you're going to have your RGB values and then you're going to put those over 255. So divide by 255 run that and that will give you your custom color so we'll see what this one is here now so it should load up now and there you go, it's a kind of a funny kind of dark green. So it's a green again, but you just play with, you just have your values. Uh, type your RGB values in there, so mess around with it, get your color that you want. And uh, that's it, thanks for watching.